But when the Fed started hiking rates last year, the industry quickly swung from feast to famine. And here's a point I wanted to add here. After the Great Recession, the government rule, rolled out something known as the Dodd-Frank Federal Reform Act, right? We'll call it Dodd-Frank. Dodd-Frank was a new set of rules and regulations which coincided with QM and non-QM mortgages. We'll say that for a separate episode, but suffice it to say that the Dodd-Frank Act in response to the Great Recession, made it very difficult from a compliance perspective for people to lend to consumer homes. Mm -hmm. There was so much that needed to be done. Most notably was something called the ability to repay rule, right? In order to make a loan to somebody, they didn't want any more stated income loans. They didn't want people making loans to somebody who said, I, hey, you know what? I make $100,000 a month. Give me a loan for this house. They, they wanted that to go away. So they held lenders to this higher standard. Oh, oh, oh so what shit. You did <laughs> in which they had to underwrite people to this strict guidance. And there were massive penalties if you didn't comply. So now we've seen a shift in the lending environment. Mm -hmm. The top five mortgage lenders in the country are non-bank lenders. Right. There's just been a massive swing from banks who traditionally are the top in this space over to non-bank lenders, largely for that reason. So this industry shrinking is impacting them right. much more because this was their only business and banks had a more diversified portfolio, but they also slowed down after the Great Recession in this type of lending. So theoretically speaking, your defaults and your delinquencies on the home loans will be should be far less this time around if unemployment stays unchanged, right? If they were underwritten according to the Dodd-Frank Federal Reform Act and the ability to repay rule underneath it and everybody did their, their job right, Right. There should, in fact, be less. But notice, defaults. notice the industry that doesn't have those acts with where they have to prove the ability to repay, like the auto loan industry, credit card industry. And look what's happening to them now. They're getting hammered. Yeah. A little slap right in the ding ding. <laughs> the backhand slap. The one that hurts. The whip. And then, and then ruminates. The, yeah. It, just, it comes it goes, like it goes up into your, into your loins. Yeah. 20 seconds later. Uh,